Watch your breath. Notice where you feel it when it comes in. Notice where you feel it when it goes out. And if it feels comfortable, you can keep up that rhythm of breathing. If it doesn't feel comfortable, you can change. Make it longer or shorter, deeper or more shallow. Sometimes it's good to start with a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths just to air everything out and to remind you that the breath is not just in one spot in the body. It can go through the whole body. We talk about breath here. It's not just the air in the lungs, but also the movement of energy that allows the air to come into the lungs and go out of the lungs. And that kind of energy is everywhere in the body. So think of it being wide open, comfortable, at ease, spacious. And then other thoughts that come in, you just let them go. You kind of think, think about the breath, but any other thought, you can just let it go, let it go. One of the images they have of someone who's Mind is trained and it's discerning as you're in a tower on top of a mountain looking down on the people below. And the people below here, of course, are your, all your other preoccupations, all your other concerns and worries. You try to lift your mind above that. There's a Pali term, atichitta, which means a heightened mind. And the mind that's not just running around in the muck of everyday affairs, but can lift itself up and can see what's important, what's not important, and can let go a lot of the the petty jealousies and the petty issues that we have. So you can see what's really important and devote your time to what's really important. So this requires a combination of concentration, which is what we're working on right now, and also discernment, the ability to see that a lot of the things you're concerned about really don't have don't really merit your concern. Or if they are things that you are responsible for, do they require that you think about them all the time? Well no. This way you can put them aside, let them go. At the very least, put them down for a while. Again, you can do that through concentration, just making up your mind you're going to stay here and not go anywhere else. Or through discernment, where you begin to see that these things really aren't worth it. The mind is much better off not getting itself needlessly entangled. This is how you lift the mind up, by, both by making it still and also by learning how to let go of things through the stillness and also through your understanding. This way the mind when it's up in that tower, it's not suffering like everybody else below. It's in a position of strength, it's in a position of clarity. When you're up there, though, then you can see okay, what's important, what's not important. Where you want to help, okay, you see that this really is worth expending energy, that's fine. But you can also say that in order to help in important things, you've got to learn how to let go of a lot of things that are not important at all or that seem important but not nearly as important as they seem. So think of this image often. Okay, you want to lift your mind above the everyday squabbles and everyday of petty affairs, all the things that everybody else is all worked up about, lip-syncing the national anthem. I mean, that's so, that's so ridiculous that people even th think about it, talk about it. There's so much more that's worth thinking about and talking about. You look at society around you, there's just so much petty stuff that everybody gets worked up about, and the important things get left behind. Well, you don't want that to happen to your own life. What other people are doing, you don't have much control over, but you do have control over your own mind. And the direction of your life is something that you can determine for yourself. So try to get up on that mountain and look around. You get a much better sense of the lay of the land. And you're in a much better position to do the right thing, to say the right thing, think the right thing. The thing that will help put an end to suffering and stress. <laughs>